I'm Joshua Bardwell, and today you're going to learn about something interesting in the Furious FPV world. Furious FPV have just released version 3.2 of the firmware for their TrueD Fat Shark Diversity module. And it's got some interesting new features. You can go read the, the release notes if you want. I'll put a link in the video description. But one of the things they claim that it does is really exciting, if indeed it's true. They claim that they have fixed those white flashes that occur. Well, it occurs in the DVR. That's where you see it the worst. But you also see it when you're flying. I kind of feel like I don't notice it as much when I'm flying. And I think that's because I'm just so focused on flying. But you definitely notice in the DVR. And they say they've fixed it. I kind of don't know how that's possible. I've always just thought that was an inherent, unavoidable fact of life when using Fat Shark goggles. And, and it's not just TrueD that does this. Uh, it happens with the original Next Wave module. It happens with LaForge. It happens with all of them. You could, let's not get into a debate over who's better or worse. I've used them all and it definitely happens to some degree with all of them. Who knows what it is or why it happens? I don't know, but Furious thinks they know and they think they've fixed it. And if that's true, that's super exciting. I've been flying with the 3.2 firmware for a couple weeks now and I do think it's better. I'm going to give you some before and after footage before being on 3.1 and after being on 3.2. And you can decide for yourself, but it, it definitely, as you know, the DVR doesn't perfectly reflect what you see in the goggles. So if you have a TrueD module that can take the 3.2 firmware, I highly recommend that you go ahead and upgrade. And it's going to be an easy upgrade, right? Because there's even a USB port on the newest version of the TrueD module. Go ahead and upgrade if your, if your module supports 3.2. I feel like it, it, if it doesn't completely get rid of the white flashes 100%, it definitely is a big improvement. Let me show you the before and after footage and you can decide for yourself. In this footage, it is the exact same copter. Uh, everything is identical about the setup except for the fact that one is on 3.1 and one is on 3.2. With that all being said, let's get to the footage and you can decide for yourself whether you think this is an improvement. Happy flying. 